In the Warring States period, Japan was almost constantly in military conflict. A samurai's armor was designed for protecting the warrior in battle. Warrior armor was originally created with solid sheets of metal, but by the Warring States period, the armor had shifted to lamellar armor. Lamellar armor is created by binding scale-shaped pieces of metal together to create smaller plates, which were then coated with lacquer to make them waterproof. The plates were then bound together with leather to overlap each other. Through the Tokugawa period, armor was still primarily made as protection for samurai, although more personalized touches, such as family crests, were added as widespread and massive battles became less common. As battles became uncommon, the need for samurai to wear armor as protection significantly decreased. As the previous need for armor decreased, creating armor became an art form. The practice of putting art on armor did not begin after warfare ended, however. The practice of adorning armor with art started as early as the 15th century in the Momoyama period, while fighting was still commonplace. Helmets, or kabuto, during this time were extremely simple, using only three or four plates. Armors during this time would attach ornaments to the kabuto, to give the samurai a presence on the battlefield. These ornaments were typically forms from Japanese culture, such as the symbols of the gods. These highly ornate kabuto were referred to as kawari kabuto, or strange helmet. As armor became more like art, samurai armor became increasingly intricately detailed. Some headpieces became so detailed and ornate that they would have been impossible to wear. Armor was frequently adorned with family crests, and menpo, or armored face masks, became very stylized. The do, which was the main torso armor which hung from the shoulders, often had brightly colored designs on it, as well as the surubashiri, the leather cover for the dough. Samurai armor, originally designed to protect the lives of the warriors who wore it, became outdated. Rather than fade away, it became a lasting tribute to the artistry of the armorers of the period and to Japanese history.